do the thing. I don't know what you did either. I I just touched it. All right, we're gonna do this really quick. <laughs> All right. That's what I figured. I just don't want to make. Sh we're good. Uh, I don't want to. We're good. I don't want to mess with anything because yeah, I'm horrible with technology. That's fine. I All I right. just put on the headset and talk. <laughs> uh, yeah, but it looks like we're getting into it. Game one. Oh no, <laughs> line the grid. All right, we're whatever. We'll ignore it. Yeah. Let's us uh, analyze. <laughs> yeah. All right, but starting off. As long off, as they can't see it. I mean, this is starting off, uh, off like any normal match. We're going to see uh, Olimar take a back seat, throw some Pikmin, rack up some early percent. And once his opponent does overcommit, he's going to grab him and he's going to get Olimar's nasty low percent strings. Oh, yeah. All right, but Rayquaza keeping, keeping the percent in his lead. He's making sure that. He's not getting destroyed. Oh my gosh, that I'm shield. I'm very curious as to why uh, Green Beast didn't try to like run shield in break? and grab or something. I guess he was afraid that, like, uh, no, Luma wouldn't have attacked when, I mean, Rose's shield was up. Like, yeah. Rose's, or Ray's uh, decision was clearly to sit there and shield. Maybe he would have gone for a spot dodge on a dash in, but I think that would have even warranted, like, yep. running up, charging an F smash. Probably. That could have broken his shield. Yeah, he definitely should have applied more pressure there in that situation because all it was was just a bunch of wasted pressure, I think. Oh, yeah. All right, but as I as this match continues, it's definitely shifted into Green Beast's uh, oh, favor yeah. for sure. He will, he allowed like all that shield pressure that he was, all that free shield pressure he was giving Rayquaza, just allowed a lot of uh, percent just attack on, and it definitely cost him a lot of. Uh, Kind of advantage in this matchup going this, forward. This usage of down smash is really good. Now has Ray been using Rosalina at all? Singles? Today? Yeah, he's been using mainly Rosa. It's once he loses with the Rosalina that you do see him switch towards Did Sheik. he use? I don't think he used Sheik against Ryuga. He did. Or he didn't use Rosa. Against he did. Ryuga. Game one. Game one. Nah? He did. Okay. Yeah, I guess I saw him using Rosa against Nam. Yep. And Rayquaza did drop the first stock. Ooh, nice up air. All right, recovering the ledge. He's got a purple, he's got a blue on him, but he only took 4%. Not a lot, but he does need to get that off of him. Don't want to give any free percent, especially when you're such a light character. And Olimar, he's building up some rage. All right, so um, Rayquaza is still struggling to get the kill. That back throw isn't going to kill. Um, Rosalina, one of her main issues is like she doesn't really have like once you get to that high percent. And this is something a lot of characters that are generally perceived as good at killing have a problem with is that like um, Rosalina um, just like once she gets you to a certain percent, it's hard to set out a. I don't know. I did something, and I don't know what I did. We're gonna fix it after the set, I think. All right, guys, I'm hopping on for uh, Ori here. He's gotta uh, do his TO stuff. We, we, we this, uh, this has been some clutch TO, to say the least. But oh yeah, I mean for what we had to work with, we even had to work uh, with a fire drill today. Yeah, we've we've got some impromptu. Um, Commentary and schedule, like we had a whole schedule and it did not work. I didn't out. even see it. <laughs> but we were supposed to commentate at like eight o'clock or something. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Ooh, wow. Luma pays the ultimate price there. Um. Oh, I thought we were gonna see an up air bait there. I think um, Green Beast just kind of he was looking for an up smash or something. Right. But he just landed on the platform and realized the spacing wasn't right. Ooh. Wow, Green Beast kind of in Beast. Rayquaza's head. Right oh yeah. Now. Really putting down the pressure I mean, with I the play, Pikmin. I play with Nam a lot. Nam is amazing, but I'm not entirely sure I've seen an Olimar that plays quite like this. I mean, no, we Green, even got Coco too. Yeah, Green Beast's stage control and like his Ooh, just the down air. All his micromanagement, and his traps are so good. Oh, cool. the beautiful good tech. Good tech. All right, we we have two blues. Two blues. Um, generally a very bad lineup for Olimar's. Unless uh, he wants to get a grab. Blue is probably the worst Pikmin, but um, it is good for killing. So when you're really trying to oh, oh no! Got him. Got him. Wow. Dirty. Close. So close. That was so smart to angle that downward. I don't think that would have hit unless it was no. angled downward. 
Rikaza he got him in the stun. Being a fiend. Oh, I got. Oh, now I did something else. Uh, let's, oh, there. Oh, wait. Oh, I think we had it. Uh, no, it's like. Oh, gosh. Help. Oh, man, Iceman, you're screwing up the monitor. Wait, did I? We got lines going all <laughs> over it. Oh, man. Wait, I, it's good. It's good. We're good. I did it. We're good. I all right. I fixed it. Here we go. I may have caused We're the set. problem, but I fixed it. As, I don't think the stream could see it. So that, that's what matters. That was That's what matters. But yeah. We were, we were looking at some lines. Yeah, there was some grids going on. <laughs> we did some, uh, like, strategic. All right, here we go. Game two. Now, interesting that no one's gonna switch up. I mean, not that Ray needs to. I don't. But yeah, I don't think. I don't think there's a switch necessary. Um, a lot of the Olimar and Rosa players, I think they both think that this matchup is even. Like this, mm. is just the general consensus between. I could agree with that. Uh, most good Olimar oh, yeah. and Rosalina players. Um, gravitational pull doesn't really benefit Rosa in this matchup. Oh yeah, that ooh, the oh the stage, stage spike. spike. And oh, Olimar's up B does run on a fuel system. Alright, he will so make it back. Very, oh very dangerous. Good tech. Rayquaza missed uh missed the down air spike there, so uh Green Beast kinda lucked out because Olimar's up B runs on a fuel system, just like Rob or Villager. Yeah. So if Ray just kept hitting him, there would eventually be nothing that Green Beast could do. We're really seeing really good adaptation from Ray. Um He's kept a lot more control oh, of this match. He's a point. lot less scared of uh, sitting in the shield. He's playing quite a bit Ooh. more aggressively. All right, taking Luma out, making sure. Yep. And now he's sitting in shield because, like, oh yeah, he's sitting on that platform, sitting on shield. Um, Green Beast knows it's not really worth to get any damage. You know, this is exactly what uh, Green Beast should do every time she loses Luma. Latch on those Pikmin. If he wants to stay back, let him. Just let All those right. Pikmin go to work. We got yellow and blue Pikmin. We are at University of Michigan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Um, Represent Michigan. Oh, all right. We're going to come back easily like that. But, yeah, like I said, having two blues in your lineup Ooh. is a very bad thing. Blues are probably the worst Pikmin. The only thing they really have going for them that up throw. is the up throw. Ooh, the up smash, though, with the purple. With the purple. And, really, Green Beast got Rayquaza back for that kill. I mean, oh, I yeah. it was about the same perception. Oh, oh, caught him, though. Headbutt. Gave it right back to him. No problem at all. Right, Ray being a little patient here. Whoa. I guess he's gonna let that blue pigment stay on his face. Got the grab. Ooh. Nice jab. Putting down this pressure on Green Beast, knowing he's gonna air dodge into the ground. Oh, good shield. Mm, there you go. He's gonna get him with the up airs. Right. These, these classic rows yeah. of frame traps, I have no Bread idea butter. why Rayquaza did not back air there. That must have been a tech error because that was mm, waiting very for easily it. Ooh. reactable. Good dodge there by Green Beast. Uh, just moving right out the way. Oh. oh, wow, forcing his Good way retaliation. down. Good retaliation, yeah. Yeah, he really, like, <laughs> waited for Yeah, that. he's like, I'm landing whether you like it or not. Because Rayquaza I'm got coming impatient down. there. Oh, oh yeah. hit by the lingering hit of Nair. Wasn't able to get mm. his smash out. Oh, caught him with that dash attack. Extended hitboxes. Oh, I Ooh. think Green Beast air dodge there. I didn't quite catch it, but that was. I think he had time to air dodge because the Pikmin extended that hitbox for me to come out a little slower. Oh, Luma's gonna catch him from the side. Oh, All right, Green he's Beast really trying to come back. So careful. Oh God, I love grab this. His management Ooh. of his Pikmin is just so smart. His mix-ups on landing are fantastic. Oh, got Luma. So All right, now's the time. Latch it on. Get he some damage. Even if Rayquaza, like, even if that roll oh, got he's away from fishing the for the smash, grab. Luma's roll was not going to come out as soon as uh, Rosalina's. Wow. Ray's just going to wait it out. He's like. He's got a purple. Yup. The purple is the opening that Olimar needs. And look Ooh. at that. He pressured Ray's shield on the platform with the There goes bears, Luma. So that he could get the purple back in front of his lineup. So that got he him. could get in on Ray again. And that's exactly what he did. Oh, he's doing what he can. I'll tell you that much. Pressure. Ray again. I sense a lot of fear from both of these players right Ray now. especially. Uh, Luma list. Oh, no. Sweating. Oh. 
came right in time for it. Lucky oh, man. That purple saved the purple. Life. And Olimar hanging on for Clutch dear purple. Life. All right, watch out for that Luma right there. Yep. Can hit you with the road smash. Oh, oh, he is so lucky. The jab didn't finish on him. Would have caught that Luma, gentlemen. That was a super good use of uh, oh, Starbucks. Wow, the hit lag of it got extended. Very good. Oh boy. All right, last shot's Pikmin. Great. Oh, he didn't go for the grab. There we go. Both Luna's players dead. are pretty and nervous. The platform is oh. nowhere to be seen. Ray is gonna have to hang back. All right, he's on the platform now. Green Beast knows he doesn't Green want Beast's to challenge. Green Beast gonna put down that pressure. Well, he's he's being a little more proactive about it now. Oh yeah. Getting up. Waiting too long though. Luma's coming Ray, right back. I mean, Ray's game plan, sitting on that platform, waiting for Luma. Ooh. Really smart. F smash. Oh, there, there goes is. Luma once again. Ray is Both gonna. Both of those yellows are dead. We have a red, which will kill. With Forty-five the seconds and a on the blue, clock. Which will kill with a grab and. Green Beast is being oh, oh, got the grab! It. Oh my god! Wow. I can't believe how Rayquaza just could Green not react quick there. enough. He he was so patient. Wow. He was down and he just slowly chipped Ooh. away and away and away. And he took advantage of Rayquaza's fear. Rayquaza stuck to the same game yeah. plan the whole time, and that was it was working. Oh yeah, but, he uh you know Rayquaza kind of fell into some habits because he was in the mentality of you do this to beat yeah. Olimar. X beats Y. Y beats Z. Um, <laughs> and so he Green Beast just caught on and he made a he couple just had to play it through. Small commitments. Oh yeah. But I mean the he, real mistake here is that uh, any time well I wouldn't say real mistake but um, uh, among them is the fact that Rayquaza every time you lose Luma you shouldn't just sit back I mean you're only gonna be a sitting duck Ray has a history of going in for those grabs when he loses Luma hey why not try again I mean I could argue it's better for him to stay back just because trying to out grab Olimar is tough uh, but hey oh, yeah. you're only uh, killing some time here we go game two battlefield interesting uh, this is good for Oh, wow, Both I like them. that. I, like, th that's so rare to see in this game is a throw to another throw because there's that second of delay. Right, there's that, that delay that is in there. But, oh, uh, by Luma. Rikaza, you know, knew the timing. Well, the thing is, I believe if you get airbound after a grab and you touch ground again, it, it resets oh, the thing. Oh, maybe. I think that so. would be really smart. Yeah, like, yeah. It's, it's kind of crazy how like much thought they put into some of this stuff. Oh, yeah. It, Programming. Like, it really does show that they kind of did pay attention to the competitive parts of the game in they some really, aspects. Yeah, they, they sure did. They, they paid attention to these details that, um, I mean, it makes it clear that it, it can cater to a hardcore audience. Okay, there goes Luma once again. Now, interesting enough, this is Smashville. No platform to just doze off on. All those platforms are stagnant. You sit there, you're gonna get pressured. So, uh, I mean, Rayquaza thought the same apparently because he did not stay back that time. He actually opted to uh, go in, be a little aggressive regardless of uh, the lack of Luma. Oh, he is so lucky that didn't spike. Wow. All right, 101. Be careful, Olimar. All right, Ray being real smart, knocking these Pikmin off as soon as he can with the Nair. Yup, and Ooh. that downer is gonna force an opening. Um, Ray oh, oh, that the was so Luma. smart. That was wow. amazing. Like that was I, just I don't even know if it was intentional. It could have just been a uh, lucky trim that Luma was in that position. Oh, there goes Luma, though. And again, in the same situation, uh, looks like he's going to go back and forth between those two platforms here. Just find the safest spot for him to uh, just run back and forth. And now uh, 3, 2, 1, there's Luma again. Oh, and you saw the down smash uh, start to come out. And again, we've got this two blue lineup that we see uh, keep see happening, and Rayquaza isn't even at up throw kill percent right oh, now. Yeah. I can't imagine on Battlefield, at least. And so, you know, two blues and a white, not the lineup Ooh. you want to have. Actually, Actually, right now, a blue Ooh, might be down able to kill. Smash. Not anymore, though. Ouch. Ouch. All right. 
Olimar. Use that purple Pikmin. Rolls that at 100%. Being a light character, purple will do it in up smash. Took care of Luma. Nope, not quite. Still in there. And that purple Pikmin is so good at separating them. Down smash? Oh, really? I thought down oh. smash hit Rosa out of her up the. It might only be yellow down smash. Wow, that. Yeah, he had a lot of really knockback there. Oh, oh, the, the tech. tech. On point with his tech. So we're good. Gonna, we're not going to be seeing uh, stage spikes here. No free right, kills. There goes Luma. Now, uh, can Green Bees take this opportunity to get that kill he really needs? Or and is we're going to. Like, Oh, Green Bee's go. patterns with these pigment. Pressure oh. with the red, then uh, zone him out with the yellow, then throw the purple. Repeat. He's Man. using <laughs> each pigment optimally. That's like super micromanaging I, there. It's just incredible. Hey, he decided to main Olimar and take the character seriously. Oh, that's, yeah. That's this, what he said. This is dedication to a oh, character. Yeah. Wow, he threw all three pigments. <laughs> That purple. But Green Beast, that all oh, Luma interrupts the grab. Oh. Now this is getting really dangerous. The with struggle the, of a tether grabber. With Rosa at that much rage in about like 10 more percent, Olimar can actually lose to the uh, Luma Gentleman, and that's not good. Oh, yeah. In fact, that'll be Ray's I mean, favorite because it's so safe. Oh, oh, boy. Yeah, now he can probably die to the Luma Gentleman. Yes. Oh, boy. Yeah. Ray's going to look for it. He, he, he decides that's the safest kill option. All right, two purples, really good versus Rosa. Oh, yeah, separate them. There you go. You know, generally you don't want a whole lot of purples, but there are a couple characters that you may. <laughs> uh, I know Luigi's one of them. Rosa, probably also another one. Mega Man. Did I say Ray? You want versus Rosa. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, the, the read. read! And actually, the Pikmin was on him, so oh. that extended the hitbox. Yeah, it and did. Made it easier. Oh, he's not making I it mean, back. Yeah, that's oh, it. And we no are going to see a stage time. spike. Wow. Quaza with maximum rage on, oh, that, yeah. on that dare. That was uh, once, that hard to tackle. Once he had a hard time getting the kill, it's just Rosa with rage just gets kind of ridiculous. The gentleman, like we said, even that could kill. Oh, yeah. It, it's oh. filthy. It's so filthy.